we're going to take a look now at the program called PDF Creator. PDF Creator allows you to combine multiple PDFs into one. First, let's, take, let's look how to download the program. Save it on your computer, and then you'll install it. And I just skipped over the downloading process here. So let's install the program now. If you want to go to the folder, just show in folder. Otherwise, just open it and run it. All right, go ahead and hit install. And it'll take just a moment. So let it finish installing. Accept or decline the extra software. All right, go ahead. You can hit start PDF creator, but it's not necessary to do this. I just do it to see if the install worked fine. And it's take, you can see it's taking a second. There we go. Now it looks like the install worked. But to actually functionally use PDF creator for me, I found I just go into the PDFs that I wanna, want to combine. So in this case, uh, we're imagining that we're combining some PDFs for grade scope and you have multiple PDFs you need to combine into one because grade scope will only accept one of those. So go ahead and open up the first page. And you're going to hit control P or go to file print. Now on your print menu, you're going to see PDF creator, select that and hit print. Now that sends it to PDF creator. Once it loads, you see there's a button called Merge. It's exactly what we're going to do. Hit Merge, and it stores the first page on PDF Creator. Now open up your second page. We're going to print our second page. Again, pick PDF Creator. It should already be selected. Make sure it is. And print. All right now off to page three. All right, go ahead and print. Make sure PDF creator is selected and print. Now off to page four. Now, once we get page four loaded, we're going to go ahead and print that to PDF Creator as well. Great. We're almost there. One thing you can do is even check PDF Creator at that merge screen and see how the documents are uploading and just check that they're all there. All right, let's go on to page five. We'll go ahead and print that page. There we go, five out of six. Some good advice there. Now that page six is loaded, let's go ahead and print that. And it will be ready to merge. There we go. Now we should see all six pages on PDF creator on the merge screen. There you go. Now, if you want, you can just select just a few and merge and you'll click merge selected.
You can sort them in different ways. Typically, I just try to print them to PDF Creator in order, and it makes it easy. The order that I want them on here. There, I click them all. I just hit Merge All to be safe. You could also hit Merge Selected there. There, now it's ready to export and save the merged PDF. And it shows you the title there. You can name it what you want. And there it shows the file location. Hit save once those two things are ready. And hit OK once it's ready. And a PDF viewer of some kind may pop up at this point and you can confirm. Let's make sure all the pages are there, of course, especially if it's a midterm or a final exam. You definitely want all of your problems accounted for. Page four, five, page six. All right, and that's how you combine multiple PDFs into one. Now this is ready to upload on Gradescope as a submission. Also, there'll be different, a lot of different scenarios in life where you're, you, they'll ask you to submit something as one PDF and you'll have to combine PDFs for that, like a college application, possibly a scholarship. Thank you.